So uh, coming in for the uh, Channel 4 News getting a nomination? That's yeah, yeah, here for, here for the, the nomination, which is for a programme we made in Egypt last year when Mohamed Morsi was uh, chucked out of office by the army. Uh, and it all happened while we were on air uh, between 7 and 8 on Channel 4 News. So that's why we're here. And I'm also giving out the Current Affairs Award. Uh, and all the nominees for that are from Channel 4, so it's going to be a good night, whatever happens. <laughs> so, so definitely party then. Is it, uh, when you're doing something like that, one of those events where, you know, it, uh, covering a world-changing event, is there any even slight inkling in the back of your mind that this might win you something as no. you cover it? <laughs> no, not on the whole. You know, you've got too many things to worry about. And, like, real events and real people and news and all the rest of it. So, no, I mean, you know, you might go back to the bar and go, that was an amazing programme and think we're going to enter that. But uh, not at the time, no. How do you keep, I mean, obviously things like the Middle East conflict, the changes have happened so rapidly. How do you even begin to, when something happens on air, make sense of it into something that you can then give as a digestible chunk? Well, the story like that is something that, you know, I've covered a lot, a lot over the last few years. And I've been to Egypt, you know, several times. And so I knew the background to it and I knew the people involved. And, um, you know, it's really about experience on something like that. You know, you've just got to know the story and know what's important about it and know what's important about what's happening and um, it's not really something you prepare for but it's just that you know if you've covered the news I've been covering the news for so long I'm so, so such a um, an old hack that um, you know you, you know what matters and what doesn't so you know and finally very quickly how do you think the business has changed in that time that you've been covering it uh, incredibly I mean look at you you know you're there with a little handy cam and a light on the top um, and uh, and you know online and Twitter and social media and all the rest of it has revolutionised what we're doing. Um, and, you know, the basic skills are the same, go out there, find a story, tell it well. But how you then distribute it is what's changed and who's watching and where, you know. Marvellous, thank you.